hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome my name is lauren um i have been off of youtube for quite some time and i'm just getting back into the groove of recording my cash stuffing videos um for those who are new i am a monthly cash budgeter i cash stuff monthly that means i get pay a paycheck once a month and you guys will see my journey and how you know i get to live a abundance life with a 95 job so let me just get right into this video i am basically cash stuffing money that i made well extra cash that i made in the beginning of the month of me um i've already cashed off my monthly paycheck for the month of me off camera i did not get a chance to record that so i do apologize also i am currently on vacation for a few weeks so there's not much going on not much activities going on in my life right now and i don't know why the money wants to fly but they're flying okay so any questions you guys have pertaining to my personal life or my cash stuffing videos you could leave it in the comment section below and i'll be glad to answer any questions that you guys have but for now we're cash stuffing 700 dollars. this is my monthly variable expenses binder and I apologize for the noise in the background. A plane is literally flying over my house. So you guys could hear that. I'm sitting right by the window. So this is my monthly verbal expenses. And what do I mean by monthly? I cashed up everything once a month and I pull out from it weekly to sustain my weekly um, lifestyle or spending habits, however you want to call it. So groceries will be getting $30 and it currently has I think $5 I will be updating the trackers at the ending of the video so 10 20 25 30. the bank gave me some um, old bills so I, I do apologize for that so groceries now has 10 20 25 30 35 and that should last me until my next paycheck, um, which is May 23rd. I did a lot of spending and um, I had a lot of outing and, you know, it was a lot. And the month hasn't even begun yet and I'm already low, low on cash. So um, household is getting 70. So I'm grateful for this extra cash that I made because I did not know how I would survive. So household has 70. 20 40 60 70 and it has a remainder oh my god so i need to put this money together so if you must know this is caribbean eastern caribbean dollar bills i am from the caribbean this is what it looks like so household now has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 87, 89. I do not know why I the bank gave me a torn bill, but it's okay. It's in my household. I hope I will try to spend it um is up. Beauty is getting Forty dollars, and I'm going to do that in two tens and let's get the fives. Ten, twenty, ten, forty, fifty, five, and it also has a balance of ten dollars from my last cash stuffing video, which I did off camera. So we have in BT 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50 dollars. Household is, let me household, sorry. Eating out 
is getting 50 and I'm just going to do a solid 50. So now it has $70. Like I said, I went out um, quite a bit. Um, this time around, we have jazz festivals going on. So I did a lot of spending and going out. Transportation, I, like I said, I'm on vacation. So you might be wondering where's my money for um, commuting to work. Um, I'm on vacation, so that that's why it's empty, but I will be doing some errands. So I'm gonna be cash stuffing in my transport envelope, $30. Um, then I'm gonna do that in 10. So we have 10, 20, 30. That should last me until my next paycheck. Miscellaneous will be getting 50, and I'm going to do that in tens as well. Two tens and two fives. So we have 10, 20. Wait, can I count? I guess not. So we should have 50. Let's see. 10, 20. 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Pretty much. And I prefer smaller bills in my variable expenses binder because I use this money on a day to day basis. It makes no sense to put the larger bills. And of course, I put the ugliest ones in there as well. Yes, has now 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. So miscellaneous has $55 and that is it for my variable expenses. On to my sinking funds. I won't be stuffing my 10K challenge this time around because I am, like I said, very low on cash because I've been doing a lot of spending. So I'm trying my very best to stuff what makes sense to me. These envelopes I got from Marianne from um, the Minimalistic budgets but i took the wrong size a long time ago <laughs> i think last year i bought these and yeah it doesn't fit so i just have them here i never use them to see so but right now i'm gonna use them because they never fit in the they could not fit in the binder i am going to get new envelopes sometime later this year so that's okay your siblings will be getting 20 dollars, and i'm just going to put a 20 my siblings envelope are for my siblings this is self-explanatory they love to ask me to borrow money so it makes better sense to have an envelope for them and i got this idea from budget with lena she has a family and um envelope, um binder at some point i will do the same but for now everything is just in i just have one binder for all my sinking funds so siblings has 20 nephews will be getting um 10 so I'm gonna do that in fives. I do have a lot of nephews, you know, so I need to start adding more money to that. So like if I could pay for the haircuts or when they build, they come give them something, I need to start stuffing that a lot more. So nephews now has 10, 15, 20, 20, 220 420 dollars okay um my aunt which is also my like my second mother she is getting 15 so i am going to do that A 10 and a 5. And has 10, 20, 25, 30. I am trying to get my hands on binders, but they are so costly when you convert my currency to US dollars. So like I could have a family binder, low priority and high priority. But for now, my one binder will just have to do. My mom is getting $20. Mother's Day is around the corner uh i honestly do not know what i'm gonna do 
So we have, she has $40. My mom is a type, she doesn't like to do anything. She doesn't like to leave her home. <laughs> but I'm kind of the same way, so she, I don't know. Fun and outing is getting $20 as well. And I'm looking for the crispier bills. So Fun and Outing now has 40. Self care has fifteen dollars. So I need to color this um because I added fifteen, so I'm going to color. And I got this as a freebie from the aesthetic dollar. I'm just gonna let this dry off before I um put it back into my envelope. So self care has 20, 30, 35, 40 dollars. I'm not sure how much you will get when this is once this is complete. So I'm eager to see. Um, wardrobe is getting forty dollars and it has dollars well six dollars left but we're adding 40 so i'm gonna do that in did i say 40 yes so now it has 46 20 50 40 42 44 46 dollars in wardrobe i did owe myself back so actually i made 800 dollars um and I, if you saw my reels, um, is it my reels on YouTube? I did see I owe like myself a hundred dollars, which I took out. So that is why I'm cash surfing seven hundred instead of eight hundred. So the money is already back in my account. Oops, is getting a solid hundred, and I will explain why. This is my oops envelope. So oops is anything that I do not have an envelope for, and something like, and I need the I need. A trans I need to pay for a transaction. So right now my um ID card has expired and I need to renew my ID. So I'm gonna use that hundred dollars soon enough to renew my ID. So that is why it's getting a hundred dollars. Um did I count? Oh sorry. So oops now has a hundred and seven dollars. Am I right? A hundred five, yeah, hundred and seven dollars in oops give some contributions my sister borrowed 50 dollars from me so i'm gonna have to put that back when she gives it to me so it has 50 dollars and i am adding five dollars so it has 55 and that is it for my low priority so moving on to my high priority um envelopes so we have holidays which is christmas or black friday whichever you want to call it and that is getting twenty dollars so now it has 40. emergency fund is getting a 25 dollars um I was watching this YouTuber and she, I think she, she's 19 and her emergency fund is 50 grand. And when I tell you, I was so amazed and I'm 28 and I don't even have that. So she's my inspiration. Let's see if we could get to a 50K emergency fund, but a little goes a long way. So emergency fund has 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75. And the only thing I regret about budgeting is that i didn't budget sooner or i didn't come across this um community sooner but you know you leave and you learn but now is the appointed time like they say um personal savings is getting 10. now with this personal savings every month money well not a lot of money 50 dollars is going to my personal savings account i do have to increase the amount but whatever I have like 
sitting in cash, I'm also going to stuff and at the ending of the year, add it to my savings account. So we have 10 20 dollars and my friend gave me a one how do they call it a trinidad and tobago one dollar bill tt dollars so that's like equivalent to 40 cents in my currency i'm not gonna use it but ten dollars and 40 cents in personal savings she went to trinidad and tobago and she brought me a bill <gasps> isn't she the cutest um first car is getting twenty dollars and i'm gonna do that in tens because i'm running out of twenties so first car has 20 40 45 50. yeah i'm 28 and i don't have a car and i live with my parents actually i'm providing for my mom and my siblings but this is everybody's life and situation is different so i am embracing the journey and hope to inspire somebody who is in my situation on youtube when me come across it this is inspiration for you vacation is getting 30 dollars 10 20 25 okay i think i should do that instead so travel now has 10 20 30 40 50 60 dollars Debt snowball, I'm not putting anything into debt. Okay, so all my debts are currently fixed assets, meaning every month there's a specific amount that goes to my debt. And right now I cannot focus on dumping all my money towards debt because life is already hard enough. And I always believe in having extra cash for unforeseen circumstances in life and we know we all get those so right now my debts are being paid on a monthly basis at some point whatever i have left i will be adding to it to just add on to my debt which is called the debt snowball method i think dave ramsey came up with this quote unquote um idea correct me if i'm wrong but the two debts that i have is my school and my building loan i took like i said i'm the one taking care of my mom and my family so these are my two debts we're getting we're getting by so it's being paid monthly it's just that extra cash whatever extra cash i have i will be slowly adding it to those debts it's really not my priority right now because it like it's being paid on a monthly basis medical care is getting 20 dollars my thing, my theory is with debt, right? You will always have debt. You'll always have something to pay. Once it's not over your head, meaning like once your debt is not too much, I don't think it should be your only main priority because you also need to live life. You need to travel. You need to have a good time. My, by all means, if you like sinking in debt, I mean, it should be your priority to lessen on your debt, but that's just my opinion so medical has 10 eh, sorry 20 40 50 60 65 70 dollars i do have a doctor's appointment next week or tomorrow i think so that will be depleted the next time you guys see me cash stuff and the only savings challenge i'll be doing is this 25 days till christmas savings challenge which i got last year from what's her name um Oh my god i forgot if i remember it i'm gonna put it on the screen when i'm editing but i got this challenge and i love it so i'm gonna do these two numbers at the top and i'm just going to put a sticker on there so i know that i did it i do not have a sharpie right now i hope you guys can see that i can barely see that so okay i did these two numbers 25 and 24 so i'm just gonna put that 50. i think i did something wrong i should not have cash left on my tree but apparently i miscalculated or oh, i skipped something i'm gonna figure it out um I don't know. 
I don't know. I do not know where I. Okay, so I'm just gonna put it in um oops because I don't know where to where what what I did. So oops. If I figure it out, I'm gonna redirect it to the right angle, but for now it's just gonna stay in there. So now oops I have a hundred, five, ten, fifteen. $17. And that is it, guys, for my cash stuffing video. See you guys in my next one. Bye.